Hello, my name is Sarah Williams, and I will be talking about how some of today's artists are promoting inclusion and body positivity within social media and other platforms. If you do not know what the body positivity movement is, here is the definition or the goal of the movement. Body positivity is a social movement initially created to empower individuals, no matter their physical weight or size, while also challenging the ways in which society presents and views the physical body. Now, there are many different definitions of body positivity swimming around in media, but today I'm going to be talking about specifically the artists that are representing this definition we just discussed. The ongoing pandemic as a whole has not helped the body positivity movement as it has been giving people more time to just sit wherever they are, judging people through their screen. Two great examples of demonstrating representation, inclusivity, and body positivity as a whole, especially recently during quarantine, are Miley Cyrus and Demi Lovato. Just in case you have not heard of these beautiful artists, they are both singer-songwriters that have been very successful, both getting their start with Disney. Recently, Demi and Miley both did an Instagram Live discussing their different tactics that they are using during the self-isolation and quarantine period. But the topic of body image issues also came up, as a lot of these issues arise, especially while we are being isolated. Demi then opened up a bit, saying, I remember being 12 years old and my body started changing. And I didn't have anybody to look at in young Hollywood at that time that had a normal body. It was just stick figures because that was what was in style. I made a vow to myself that when I get older, I want to represent what I didn't have. I want to be that for somebody. This is a great tie back to what some of my other group members have discussed, specifically the need for representation in the arts and why inclusivity is important. Miley also opened up and talked about a situation that was very hurtful to her. She was included on the MTV Video Music Awards and people were making very offensive memes about her body and comparing it to a turkey. She then was honest and I quote, I didn't wear a bikini for two years after that. Memes can be so funny, but also so hurtful. That was such a wake up call to me for wanting to use my platform for a bigger purpose. Demi then was very honest with her fans and started talking about how important it is to not get consumed in negative self-talk and negative body image. This goes for everybody. We're confined into these spaces with the same mirrors, the same negative thoughts, Demi continued. It's important not to beat ourselves up over getting nervous or not eating perfectly or working out perfectly. These are different, very scary times. We've never been through this, it's okay. Be gentle with yourself as much as possible, Demi concluded. Although this Instagram Live was done a little over a year ago, Miley and Demi continue to demonstrate body positivity and inclusivity through their platforms. Miley continuously breaks those social norms with her very outgoing Instagram posts. Demi posts many pictures of her body even though she has also struggled with body image in the past and I'm sure in the present. These artists are huge celebrities, but they do deal with the same issues that normal people do. At the end of the day, they are normal people. But these artists have done and will continue doing such a good job, including uh, people of all sizes within their platform. There are many artists that have done similar things to liberate the body positivity movement, such as Lizzo with her plus size model and dancer search for her music videos, Hilary Duff, Anne Hathaway, etc. It is so important that these artists do use their platforms for good and many of them are still doing a wonderful job.